Hey friends, I wanted to leave a quick video, just something something was on my heart, and I just wanted to say that if there's any video that I make, or anything I say, and even in the slightest, if you think it's disrespectful to the memories of Chris Kramer, or Liz Ann Froon, please leave a comment and say, hey, you know, that's disrespectful, please let me know, because I'm not intending that at all. Actually, to the contrary, to be honest with you, I... <laughs> I, I I think I have more respect for Les Hanford and Chris Kramer than the average person who looks into this case does. You know, on quite a few different occasions, I've seen people say, ah, oh, see, this is what happens when unprepared city women go into a rainforest. And, you know, that, that kind of bothers me a little bit because I, I think we're kind of lowering the, the capabilities of Les Hanford and, and Chris Kramer's. You know, first of all, both of them were college educated. They got their degrees. This was actually a graduation gift. So they are college educated. I'm not saying if you're college educated that you're, you're, you're if you're not college educated that you're better than you, someone who is. I, I'm, I'm just saying that college is something that is tough for a lot of people to go through. And, you know, it, it's a journey. And it, it's tough. And to go through college and to graduate, it, 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 it's a good feather in the hat. And it's something that both Chris Kramers and, and, and Liz Anfern did. And not only did they graduate from college, but they graduated while working. They, they, they both had jobs at the same restaurant, and, and they worked. You know, it, it's one thing just to go and, and hang out and party at college and, and, and go to the couple classes that you, you know, you know have to and, and just party. Or, or They actually worked. And actually, from Liz Ann's viewpoint, she played volleyball. I don't know how much you you really thought about it, but playing a, a sport in college is really tough. I I had the opportunity to wrestle in college, and I chose not to just because, well, making weight for wrestling and actually, you know, all the rest, the grueling wrestling practice and, and trying to keep the grades up. You know, I that, that was an awful big task. Now, as far as cutting weight, that's not something you do in volleyball. But, you know, I mean, a college sport is a tough sport. And, you know, Lisanne Froon, she, she played volleyball, she graduated, and she worked in college. And while we're talking about the women's capabilities, Chris has also, you know, she's, she went to Panama before and she had experience there. So let's not act like these are two city women who had no idea and, and were un incapable because I think that we're missing the gist of who they are. Do they make mistakes? Yeah, who doesn't make mistakes? We all make mistakes. But I think it really disrespects them if we totally, you know, if, if we ignore all the thing, all the things that point to the foul play theory. So anyway, I just wanted to leave this video. Thank you for watching and God bless you. Thank you.